Hey everyone, it's Mark Weens with Migrationology.com. I'm in Georgetown, Penang, Malaysia. And for dinner tonight, I am at a restaurant that serves Hainanese food. And Hainan is the little island right off the south of China. Um, and oh, the food has just arrived. Thank you. They have no menu, so you just kind of walk in here and uh, um, they just kind of recommend some dishes um, and you decide what you want to eat. Um, and I'm sure everything on their menu is good. And I think the food is sort of a mixture of Hainanese and Penang Malay style food, uh, but it's definitely old school and I can't wait to try the food. This is one of their signature dishes, which is, these are like, long pieces of thin pork stir-fried with I'm not even sure but very dark dark sauce and actually let me just smell that real fast that almost smells like uh, uh, cha su bao so it almost has like that Chinese barbecued pork aroma to it it's garnished with some cucumbers and onions let me take some of that along with the pork onto my rice and Let's try this. Mm. Mm. My first taste definitely reminds me of a cha siu bao. Um, it, I think, I think I can taste hoisin sauce. Maybe. I think that's what it is. It has that really kind of like dark soy sauce, nutty flavor to it. Almost like a plum, almost like a plumish flavor. Mm, a little bit sweet and a little bit salty, uh, but yeah, very good. And that pork is tender. Okay, and then this one is tofu, stir fried with leeks, and I think there is some minced pork in here as well. Oh, this looks amazing. Okay, put that there and mix in with that. Oh, that is awesome. That tofu is just melt in your mouth soft. Very smoky flavor to it. And then that crispness from those leeks, uh, which are like meaty green onions. Oh, that's, that's awesome. Okay, and then this one here is the Assam prawns. So, yeah, these are with the head on, the tail on. These look like they are, I don't know if they're deep fried or just like maybe pan fried in oil. Let me see, that That tail might be kind of kind of hard to eat as it looks pretty thick. Um, but let me try the, the body first. Oh, beautiful meaty prawns. They just have a very lightly sour flavor. It almost tastes like a balsamic vinaigrette that's been like fried onto the prawns. Just very light, but very, very good. Oh man. And yeah, of course you know my love for prawns and shrimp. I just love them. I was gonna try to not order this dish, <laughs> but then I just, after tasting the other dishes, I just could not resist. But this is another one of their signature dishes, which is the curried fish. And, oh, this just looks beautiful. Oh, we got, looks like we got the tail and the head. So actually, let me take some meat off the tail. Oh, this looks and smells ridiculously good. I don't know how I was kidding myself, how I was gonna try to not order this. <laughs> okay. Okay, put that on the rice, and I think that's, okay, there we go. A little more of that soup. Okay, I'm glad we ordered that. And there is a very unique flavor in that curry, an earthy, bitter flavor, which, Actually, to me, it tastes very similar to uh, Vietnamese coriander, but I'm not sure if that is an ingredient in there or not. But it really has that kind of, um, it's like a green, earthy, like herby flavor, which comes in very, very strongly. That fish is just so, oh man, that fish is just incredibly um, soft, yet it's not mushy at all. And then that, wow, yeah, I think I could drink this curry as well.
It's just very, very light and almost tastes like a puree of onions and it might be the, they might be using the, the torch ginger flower in here. I'm not, actually I'm not really sure because I just see little pieces of things. Um, but anyway, that is outrageously delicious and definitely has that earthy, herby flavor to it. That is a drinkable curry. This has been another excellent dinner here in Georgetown. The food, everything was delicious. Uh, but that curry fish, I'm glad I ordered it. I loved the tofu, the pork, the prawns, everything was amazing. Uh, this is an awesome old school Hainanese restaurant and it just has a real home, old school feel to it. Uh, really good food, friendly owners, and I enjoyed dinner here tonight. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please remember to give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment below. I'd love to hear from you. And thank you very much for watching this video. See you on the next video.